this is Gordon Warner with Black Buffalo Global Missions, and I wanted to bring you a couple of updates on our work in Uganda. We are excited to uh, have all the windows and doors painted. As you know, we've had them installed and they put the glass in, but there was just a primer on the doors and windows. And so just as last week, we've had them all painted to look, uh, match the rest of the building. And it really looks good, as you can see in the pictures. We are so glad to pretty well have now all of the outside work on our building done. So now we are turning our attention to the inside. I want to tell you about the washroom situation that we have in Luero right now. Uh, when we were there, well, they first started out with a really rough outhouse with not even a door on it. And we built new washrooms, which are called long drops. And uh, these were just little brick buildings with a dirt floor. And in this, um, with these buildings, there was no way to sanitize the walls, the floors, or anything. And also, these holes all filled up. And so we were told we need to dig another hole. And so we're going to redo the washrooms entirely, um, making them with a tile wall so that we can clean them. We will be hiring someone to do that every day and probably several times a day when the school is in. And uh, this will cut down on uh, problems that we've had with our girls and getting infections and things. And so we're really excited about that. And that's where we are right now. So right now we are, are, they are digging a hole. I mean, if this was Canada or the U.S., we would have a uh, backhoe out there and we would just be digging a real problem with the dump truck. But in Luero, Uganda, it's a little bit different. You can see the guys are digging it by hand. And so our hole is going to be over, it's about 60 feet deep. And it's about a good five, six feet wide and about 12 feet long. And so we're going to be able to wash him over that. But the good news is, because the hole is so deep and so big, we are going to be able to uh, tap into the washrooms that are going to be in the children's home. So right now we are doing the plumbing for the children's home and it'll be connected to this great big hole. So we're it's coming along. Our next uh, part will be doing electrical and then finally the plastering and, and then all the fixtures and stuff. So we are so thankful for your support. Without your support, we couldn't do this. So God bless. And again, don't forget to subscribe. I hit that button and so you can get all of these updates.